All right, so I have Fernie here. I put um, I put it in the wheelbarrow, and I also filled it with water, and I put some fertilizer in the water so it, it can absorb some fertilizer, and it's not too it's not too dry. I'm gonna give it a little extra TLC, and also what I'm gonna do on camera with you guys. Um, I have never done this before, but I am going to divide this stay corn into a couple sections because it's very large and I want to mount a part of it to my front porch. So we are going to do that together. Make sure I got, I got it in good view here. So I'm going to take this part this part right here let me, let me just see I'm gonna take this part right here and I'm gonna cut that off and I think I'm gonna cut this part off too so that's what I'm gonna do right now and if I mess this up uh, you let it learn right so I got me a knife and I'm just gonna cut it or something but anyway there we go I got this part here that I cut off and I'll let this I put some bricks in here so it would weigh the wheelbarrow down I'm gonna put this in here and let it really soak up some fertilizer oops well that's in my way right now so now I'm also gonna cut this part off this section so you can see there's a plant coming out here and a plant coming out here. So I'm gonna try to get this little one here. I'm just gonna do this. It's like cutting a piece of, cutting broccoli or something, but not. So now I have two. So I have this, I'm gonna let this absorb some of this water so that it gets fertilized and I think I might stop there for now since I'm a novice and I've never done this before and um, so I will have two put my knife down I will have two pieces of this fern to mount and I'm not sure exactly what I'm gonna do with it yet but I'm gonna figure it out um, I did read, or not read, but I, well, I saw a video where you can cut this part off, and so it's easier to mount, so I'm going to do that, cut this part off. So, I did there, and so that'll be easier to mount. I'm going to take this out so it doesn't take up any of that fertilizer that it doesn't need to, and... This part, I don't think I'm gonna cut any more of that off. I'm just gonna let this soak in this fertilizer. Um, so what I did was I took some Miracle Grow fertilizer and I filled the wheelbarrow up so it can, um, I can saturate this pretty baby for any, um, for any lack of nutrients that it's had on the few weeks that it's been hanging on my Hong Kong orchid, um, not getting enough shade. So we're gonna give it a little extra TLC and we'll take it from there. And then when I get ready to mount, I will show you how I mount this onto the tree and onto a board. This part onto a tree, this part, part onto a tree and these two onto a board. We'll take it from there. All right. 